We're walking from here. But walking where? We could be anywhere. Everything looks the same from down here. Oh, and there's no way of knowing which way to go. Clink! Where did you find that? Oh, uh, I don't know. Here on the ground. Is it yours? know where we are. Tinkerbell, this is so fascinating. Thank you. I had no idea fairies were responsible for changing the seasons. I thought it had something to do with the Earth's axis as it rotated around the sun. <laughs> That's what we wanted you to think. Well, I think we've covered everything. Oh, I hope Father's impressed. And now, for the finale. The whole fairyland, Pixie Hollow. It worked! Oh, Tinkerbell, I can't wait to show Father. Tinkerbell? Are you all right? Tinkerbell? Huh? Oh, sorry. Y yeah, let's go show your dad. Looks like the rain has set up, son. You might be able to make it home to your friends now. Maybe this could help you. Oh, yes. Such a clever tinker. Take care of yourself. I'll never get you, Tinkerbell. You best hurry. The break in the weather may not last long.
And I'll never forget you, Lizzie. It's just like your field journal. It's filled with lots of facts. Yes, yes, that sounds wonderful, but I, I'm in the middle of a potential catastrophe here. I, I can't look at it now. But, Father, it's a field journal, and I... I don't have time. I have to find some way to deal with all these leaks before they destroy my work. When will you be able to look at it? Oh, I don't know. Maybe later. You always say that. Tinkerbell! You came back! I'm so glad to see you. Oh, Tinkerbell, Father has no time for the field journal. I think I can fix that. Lydia, you sure you know where you're going? Yes. Tinkerbell and I walked by here. I just have to find the road. Road? That road. <gasps> that road. That's not a road. That's a muddy river. So, I guess we need to find a bridge. Or be spontaneous and jump right in. <laughs> it's not deep. We can walk across. Yeah, no, I don't really do mud. But you're a garden fairy. <laughs> Ironic, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Okay, all right. I'm coming. Where is she? Oh, what was that? <gasps> She's stuck. I can get myself out of here. All right, all right. Someone just. Get me something to grab onto. Got it. Planky. Rescue device. Right, Bubble. You can count on us. Okay. Let's give this a try. Do you feel that? She's starting to break free. I don't think so. Rescue, D-Voice. Oh, you scared the petals right off of me. Did we miss anything? My, what a splendid tea service. I am really quite impressed. Then I say, oh, Why, thank you, Tinkerbell. Oh, you are too kind. You hold your pinky out like this. And that's the way... You throw a proper tea party. <laughs> Good 
Good night, Lizzie. Aren't enough hours in the day. Good morning, Tinkerbell. How did you sleep last night? Well, I... Actually, I didn't. But, but that doesn't matter. You should go downstairs to your father. Lizzie? Yes, father? Good morning, my dear. All the leaks seem to have stopped. I just wanted to make sure everything is okay in here. Oh, yes, just fine. No leaks at all, so... <sighs> Strange. It's as if they mended themselves. It's still raining outside. I can't imagine how on earth such a thing could occur. <laughs> well, there must be an explanation that I'm just not thinking of. Well, I'm sure you'll think of it, Father. Ooh. Off we go. Perhaps down in your study you always do your best thinking there. I wish you luck. Well, uh, play nicely. Yes, of course. <laughs> Bye, Father. Oh, that was close. What are you doing? This is your chance. Is that why you fix those leaks? So he can spend more time with me. I've really been wanting to show him this. Okay, okay, I'll go. Father, since you have more time, maybe I can show you my scientific research. The butterfly is gone. What? The Apertura Iris with the irregular wing pattern. I was going to present it to the museum tonight. Oh, this was my big opportunity. And now it's gone. Elizabeth, did you release it? No. Well, I didn't do it. And since there is no one else in the house, there is only one logical explanation. It must have been you. I didn't do it, Father. 
I'm going to give you one more chance. Tell me the truth. I could tell you, Father, but you wouldn't believe me. Very well. Off to your room, young lady. I'm very disappointed in you. You know, I was just thinking, if Tink were here, how not quiet it would be right now. <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Who am I? Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the exact shade! <laughs> <laughs> Quite a bit of spirit in that little tinkery. <laughs> that's for sure. In fact, I still can't believe she got captured. Yeah, it's very unlike Tink to be caught with her guard down. I wonder what really happened. Well, we'll find out soon. Yep. With every step we take, we come closer and closer to Tinkerbell. She'll tell us what happened. Listen, um, <clears throat> there's something you all should know. <sighs> Tinkerbell getting trapped is all my fault. <gasps> I slammed that door on Tinkerbell to teach her a lesson. I tried to get her out, but the door was stuck. I tried, but I couldn't. And now I've put her and all of us in danger. I am so sorry. Oh, honey, this is not your fault. We all know that Tink can get into plenty of trouble all by herself. It scares me to think what would have happened if you weren't there, Lydia. I don't know what to say. How about faith, trust, and, and pixie dust, and pixie dust. Can you reach it, Clanky? Almost, just a little Here, more. Okay, now can you see anything? No, there's a big building in the way. Building? House, build, house. That's it, Clanky. We got it. What we got? House, house. Oh, sorry. I can't feel my legs. It doesn't matter what I say. He never believed me. I'm so sorry, Lizzie. I'm so glad you're here. You're my best friend. I wish I were a fairy, just like you. Then I could help the flowers bloom and talk to animals and fly around with the other fairies all the time. That would be fun. going going on out there. Oh, no. I was going to present it to the museum tonight, and now the butterfly is gone. Oh my! 
I... Tinkerbell is upstairs. The little girl has her in a cage. <gasps> <gasps>